on their first play from scrimmage. Roethlisberger out of the gun to keep an eye on Antonio Brown. They try to feed it to Brown early in a matchup with Boye, and it's incomplete. Well, they're going to press him on the line of scrimmage, try to disrupt him in his pass route there. And a good job by Boye. Roethlisberger a little quick with a pass. Brown did not get out of his break fast enough because of the coverage and the contact by Boye. Brown had 10 catches, 157 yards in the first meeting, but most of that damage was done once it became obvious Jacksonville was winning two yards per carry. Obviously padded by the 90-yarder. Toss to the outside, caught by Brown. He's got a first down. So Brown gets his first touch in a matchup with the outstanding young corner, Jalen Ramsey. And the crowd reacts. It covers 11 yards. Yeah, you go to your playmakers. Bell first down, and now here is Brown with the catch and the determination and drive to pick up the first down. Ramsey with a lot of cushion that time on Brown allowed for that short pass to be turned into a first down. NFL record five straight seasons with 100 or more catches for Antonio Brown. Held in check, 15 carries, 47 yards back in week five. Play fake. Roethlisberger looks downfield, nearly intercepted. Pozlozny, Aliquippa PA's Paul Pozlozny with a diving attempt at the INT. Now it looked like Roethlisberger had a chance to uh, pick up yardage on the ground here. You can see the coverage by Ramsey on Brown and Bell in the backfield from the gun. Roethlisberger steps, fires, end zone. It's caught! Antonio Brown! Touchdown, Steelers! Another unbelievable catch by Antonio Brown. Well covered by A.J. Boye. But the confidence that Roethlisberger has in Brown is unmatched. You can't get better coverage than that. Claiming he was pushed off, but uh, look at the subtle move there by Brown. Brown caught the football and Boye's arm. Basically caught the ball with his right hand as he was almost holding hands with Boye in the back of the end zone. First touchdown Boye has given up this season. A Pro Bowl season for Boye who came over as a free agent from Houston. Big Ben went four of five on the drive. The extra point from Boswell. Roethlisberger looks to the heavens. The Steelers are finally on the board. Swish for Brown. <laughs> ben did not like the wide open tight end right down the middle. Watch Jesse James go down here. He'd rather go for the challenge. And the challenge is from A.J. Boye on Antonio Brown. Great coverage, incredible concentration, but what's new for Antonio Brown? with Bud Dupree in on the stop. Most times targeted without allowing a touchdown. Boye did not give up a touchdown during the regular season. And you can see why. He had absolutely perfect coverage on Brown who was trying to work his way back to the corner of the end zone. But the ball placed perfectly by Big Ben. And that hookup at times, just like that, unstoppable. Well, you've been doing this for six months. Just do the things that got you here. Steelers are trying to get back to that. And Antonio that, Brown with a catch and a first down. That's really a good way to get back to it. Get it to your best players. Antonio Brown looks totally 100% healthy coming off that uh, calf injury. Three catches, 47 yards. They need another seven yards or so to get into Boswell range. Roethlisberger, he hits Antonio Brown. And right at the target line, 25-yard line. They're down by 14. Roethlisberger in the pocket. Roethlisberger, rainbow delivery to Brown and a first down. Matched up with Jalen Ramsey, 27 yards on the catch. That's a great way to start a drive in answering the uh, touchdown by the Jaguars. Go to your best player. Antonio Brown beating Ramsey easily with a crossing route. And out to midfield go the Steelers quickly. You ask Ramsey, how do you match up with Brown? He said you have to mix it up against him. Press, give him some room, 
He's so smart, but his job is to lock up. That's how he always views it. He also learned that you don't get calls against him in the first meeting. Roethlisberger gets out of trouble, throws it deep downfield. Oh, what a grab! Antonio Brown, touchdown, sensational! Well, you're looking at this and you go, why doesn't he run for it? It looks like he could have run for it, but the faith and belief and confidence that Roethlisberger has in number 84 again on display. Coverage by Boye, almost perfect. But the ball placement to the inside by Roethlisberger as he threw it basically on the run results in another spectacular touchdown for the Steelers. On fourth down, for the second time today, Roethlisberger has thrown a long touchdown. Brown, his second of the afternoon. Six catches, 121 yards. Calf problem? Not so much. It's a seven-point game. Antonio Brown, superhuman for Pittsburgh. It's tight at Heinz Field. 36 yards out, and then on fourth and five, another spectacular catch by Antonio Brown from 43 yards out. Brown, six catches, 121, two scores. His wife, Terry Ann, their children, Melanie, Christopher, and Lindsay, and their grandchildren. We love you all. And Thank you for sharing the great man with us, all of us. A high throw from Ben Roethlisberger with 4.09 to play here in the fourth. 25 yards for the tight end McDonald. Roethlisberger off the hands of Jalen Ramsey, matched up with Antonio Brown. As is an interception dropped by Ramsey, this would have ended things right now. Roethlisberger throwing the ball to the outside to Brown, and that's where Ramsey was. Ramsey, who told us he wants to be looked at as the greatest cornerback since Deion Sanders. Roethlisberger, pump, run, backward pass to Le'Veon Bell, accelerates for the touchdown. Oswald lines it up, they're going to go for it on the onside kick. The ball is deflected, and it's recovered by Jacksonville. And the holder from 45 yards away. It is right down the middle. Because of the penalty. Roethlisberger tosses to the outside, Antonio Brown. And he's down inside the five, but didn't get out of bounds, so the clock continues to roll. Roethlisberger connects the Jacksonville Jaguars have pulled off the upset of the playoffs the Jaguars are in the AFC championship game for the first time since 1999